I divide my time between two major areas of work. One is the human innovation piece and the other is the gender equity piece. Now, in my mind, those two things are very, very tightly linked to each other because any human being on the planet who is silly enough to think that we are not going to have enormously higher levels of innovation by, by engaging women deserves not to be a leader anywhere in my in my view of the world. So for me, gender diversity and gender balance and gender balance teams are one of the biggest engines of innovation that the world has left completely untapped. So it would be remiss of me, I would have left it out if I hadn't said, if, if I was to say I work in human innovation and I don't care about gender balance. And also because I happen to be a woman and because I have been discriminated against because I've been a woman and because I don't want that to happen to the generations behind me, including my own daughter, I am determined that we will not just move the needle for women, but that we will actually change the game. And for me, the way that we change the game is not by jumping up and down and saying that if we're going to have 10 men in a room, we also need to have 10 women. It is by saying that by having gender balanced teams, we will be more innovative. We will solve global problems more effectively. We will have better legislation. We will have better leadership. We will have stronger governments. We will take less risks. We will serve more people. We will deliver better technologies. All of that happens when you have gender balanced teams.